All right, guys, this is a tutorial for clipping mask and how you can take images and drop them into certain shapes. So these are Facebook ads, and uh, for each one, we've got clipping masks set up so that we can drop images into them and make them with this white border. That way they look better than a web preview. Um, let me go ahead and take these off, and we'll just work with this one image. So um, the keyboard shortcuts are at the bottom. And you can see what uh, letter or anything that I'm pressing. So um, for the for this one, what we I want to show you how this is broken down. So we have the left rectangle, and we have a right rectangle. So these are rectangles that can be moved around, and then you can actually put images inside of those rectangles. So the ones that we have are this one and this one, but we'll add new ones in. So go to File and Place Embedded, and you want to find the images that you're going to use to drop in. So we'll use um, this and this, so a front and a back image. So pick your front one, click Place. You can also drag and drop these. And then for the second one, Place Embedded, and we'll use the back option of that outfit. So click Place here too. So we want to position these above the right or the left rectangle. So I usually do the the front image on the left rectangle and then the other image on the right. Um, that actually looks kind of funny how their arm is there. <laughs> anyway, okay, so um, if you don't have this little arrow, you can click the Alt button. So let me just take it back to how it would normally be. So it just show the image right here on top. You click the layer that you want to work with and move it around. And notice how this is all messed up around the side. So once you bring your image in, make sure it's above the shape and hold your Alt key and click it and it'll drop it into that shape so we get the border. Then you can click on the picture layer and you can move it around. And then it'll stay within these this border that's set up. So we just kind of want to center it in here. And then we'll do the same with the other one. Hold Alt and click on top of the image puts the border around it and then we can move the image around to cover up the blue. And then so what I've also got on these are color adjustments. So if I turn those off you can see how it's a little dim. Um, but if I turn the color adjustments on it brightens the image up and makes it look a lot better. So uh, once you get done with that you can rename the layer to whatever it is and um, we're gonna call this uh, plaid cardigan. I'm not sure if that's what it's called, but that's what I'm going to do. And then you can right click on the layer and go to do a quick export and then drop that into drop into the Facebook ads and daily Facebook posts. And let's see here. Week of the 22nd. So I'll add a new one. October 22nd. I'm going to put it into this folder. And then just click save and then that'll put it into that folder. So we've got plain card again. If you open up the image, you can see that it's got all the adjustments that we made on it. And then you can upload it to Facebook like that. So hope this was helpful.